Next, in this video, I'm sharing what is in my diaper bag that I'm carrying around for Bentley. This is my Camo Day Tripper by Stellan Dot. And when I showed you guys this in my spring collection video, a lot of you were interested to see what is inside. So this bag, I, I love this bag so much. I was using a backpack diaper bag for a little while, but it didn't hold as much stuff as I like to carry around with me. Before that, I was using my Louis Vuitton Neverfull, which I love, but also, you know, to pack clothes and bibs in there, it just got, it was too small to do that. It was good for just like diapers and wipes, but for all the other stuff, I needed something a little bit bigger. And this bag is the perfect size. It is a wipeable fabric on the outside and it has an expandable pouch here. So I don't expand it because as I've said, if I do open it up, then I'll use the space and I'll make my bag heavier than it needs to be. So I don't need it, but should you need it, it does expand into a little bit of a bigger bag. So I love this, it has an outside pocket. The straps aren't super long, so they fit very comfortably on your shoulders, and they're soft, and then they have a leather for extra added support. The best part about this bag is the inside, it's floral. The floral and the camo together is match made in heaven in my opinion. So let's just dive in, I'll show you what I have on the outside. On the outside, I'm playing with the settings because the sun is going in and out. So my cell phone, this is a loopy case that I keep on my phone and I do have a promo code if you guys are interested. It is for 10% off and I love this. I really enjoyed using the pop socket case. You guys asked me how I like that one too but I actually like the loopy better just because I can carry it like this if I really want to. Pop socket is an adhesive so there was always that fear that it would come undone and this one is actually, and here we go with this one again. This is really hard to see but this one is actually through the case. So it's very, very, very secure. I hope I'm not being obnoxious with the light settings in this video. It is very bright in here and therefore I need to get used to it. And the other thing I keep on the outside is my wallet. I've come a long way. Becoming a mom, I downsized. I love having the bigger, longer wallets, but it's just not feasible right now and it just adds weight to an already heavy bag. So I love these little card holders and I don't really carry cash on me all that often. So really it's just my debit card and like store cards. So that's in here and then my license obviously and cash if I have it. And I like this too because if I'm running in and out of stores, I could just grab this. The only other thing I don't have in here that I usually keep is my key fob on my car. So those three things I just always need to have access to. So those are all tucked inside there. Perhaps not. All right, Siri. Then on the inside, there is a zip pocket, a large zip pocket, and in here I just have an extra pacifier. And on the other side, it's just two little slots. So I have a wider slot, which this is really random, but I keep gloves. These I keep for Addie. So when Addie is on chemo and she goes to the bathroom, we have to glove up because the chemo and her urine, if it gets on my hand, could absorb into my bloodstream. So and if she gets chemo for 48 hours, we have to glove up. So I always keep these in my diaper bag just because if she needs to go to the bathroom, I have those. So that's not for Bentley, but still needed. And then on this side, I have my sunglasses, which I probably could use right now because it's so dang sunny outside. These are also Stellan Dot. They are the black aviators, and I like these so much, and you guys always ask about them when I'm wearing them. Most people think they're Ray-Bans. They are not. They are way cheaper than Ray-Bans, and I think the same quality, if not better, in my opinion, and they're just very top gun. I love them. So I just have those kind of hanging on the little slot there. I have my hand cream. This is the first Aid Beauty Intense Therapy hand cream, which I can't get enough of. A pen, some cinnamon gum, it's my favorite, Trident Cinnamon, and then I always have some kind of lip products. This is what I'm wearing right now. This is the Buxom Rose Julep. You guys always, always ask me what is on my lips when I have this on in my Instagram. So that is my lip cream. So that's just kind of like, you know, I've gone from like a bag of stuff for me to like a little itty bitty pocket. <laughs> Times have changed. Okay, so for the inside, the biggest part of the bag. Um, I usually don't keep this in the bag, but I wanted to mention this. This is usually on the car seat. This is a milk snob cover. If you are a mom and you carry around a car seat or you are nursing, this is amazing. 
I didn't have one of these with Addie. I would always just carry a swaddle and put the swaddle over me when I was nursing, but this is amazing. So it's a car seat cover and it's stretchy and I've washed this a thousand times. It's still really good. So it stretches over the car seat, which I love, especially because we're often in and out of the hospital. There's germs and I feel like this just keeps stuff away. It also makes it really dark so he sleeps really well when this is on him. It's breathable and then it also doubles as a nursing cover. So again, when I'm out places, I always have it. I just slip it over, covers, comes down really long and I can nurse him under here. It's really thin and comfortable for me and for him. So if you guys aren't familiar with them, I think they got their start on Shark Tank. They're often like on Daily Deal websites too. You can get these for cheaper than what they are. So these, this is usually always on the car seat, but I threw it in here to mention it. This is always with us on the go. Then I have my little diaper caddy and I actually just got this not too long ago at Walmart. I wanted to see if I would like it. Before I had this, I was using a, a Stellandot pouch that kept my diapers and my wipes in there and my changing pad. But this is kind of all in one and it folds up. So it opens, it's all connected. It opens up, this is a changing pad, which is nice because you know when you're out places, you just never know if you're gonna need to do a diaper change. And then at the bottom here, I have diapers. We use the Honest diapers, he's in a size three. And then the wipes. And the other cool thing about this that I've seen different on the other little diaper caddies is these are the little poop bags. I actually used to use these for Jake all the time. But these are great, again, if you're out, not in a restaurant or something, but if you're at your someone's house and you wanna dispose of a smelly, dirty diaper, instead of going right into the garbage, you can use one of these wipes to conceal the smell. But the other thing I really love these for is for blowouts that get on the clothes. So when you're out and you have a massive blowout to tend to, you can take off the clothes and put them in one of these bags. You're not putting them in the bag with all the rest of your stuff. So these individual bags are amazing. When I had a diaper bag with Addie, I had them too. I still have them in here. I'm going to show you. That's one thing I always keep in my diaper bag. So yeah, so far this is working out good. Uh, the only thing I can't do that I could do with my other changing pad is I could throw that changing pad in the washer. This one is easy to wipe clean. Thought, oh, it has a pouch here on the outside. I just noticed. I literally have only had this for like a week and a half, but I do like that it's compact and I can, you know, change this from bag to bag. So that makes it convenient. And then in this little pouch, these are those Sugar Boo canvas pouches that I love. And then in here is kind of my little arsenal of products. So like I said, I've only carried that for, so I always have this in my diaper bag. This is a roll of trash bags, little diaper bags. And I just recommend everybody always have these. And to go with that, I always have a stain remover spray. This one's by Dreft and I can't tell you how many times this has saved me. I put this on my Instagram story a while back. We were in the hospital with Addie. Bentley had a massive blowout all over his clothes, all over my leggings. Uh, I did not pack an extra pair of clothes for myself, but I was able to rinse out his clothes in the sink, stain stick it, put it in the bag, and then I did them. I put it in the laundry as soon as I got home and magically all the stains lifted. So this goes with me everywhere. Now that I have the little trash bags attached in that diaper caddy, I don't think I'll need to carry this as much anymore, but always have a good stain stick on you. You just never know. And then I also have a diaper balm. This one is from my good friend Lily. She has a shop on Etsy with a whole bunch of products using surrounding essential oils. So this is her soothing diaper balm. I think this is my third or fourth jar of this stuff. It is so good. Smells so good, doesn't irritate him. It has the best consistency. I just love this stuff so much, even better than the butt paste, which I was a very loyal fan of before I switched over to this. I also have his little vitamin D drops, a hand sanitizer. I have a nose spray for myself because I am stuffy at the moment. I have saline drops for him. I have a little nail clipper for him that I keep with me at all times because this boy gets hangnails all the time. A lip remedy from First Aid Beauty for me. A thermometer. I keep this on hand mostly for Addie but also for Bentley too because if Addie spikes a fever at any moment we have to basically run to the hospital and so when we're out and about I just like to have this because you just never know and it's also really good to keep on hand for Bentley too. And then the only other thing I have are a couple of these little Baltic Amber teething bracelets, necklaces. So that's all 
this stuff and I like keeping them in this pouch because if God forbid anything were to spill it's concealed and not all over everything else in the diaper bag so and I like this too because I could just pull this in and out of my bag all right so then I just have the necessities I always keep two two chain two what am I trying to say two sets of clothing so I always have like a onesie like a one piece. I like these as jammies if we're out at my parents or my in-laws we end up staying late and I wanna change them, or just as an extra outfit. Honestly, I actually prefer the one pieces versus the two pieces. I just feel like they're easy, I feel like he's more comfortable, so I always have one of those and then I always have some onesies and a pair of pants. So this is a little short sleeve onesie, little rams. They had a good year, had a good year. And then a long sleeve onesie, and some sweatpants, some cozy pants just in case. And I always have an extra pair of socks. And then because he drools like a bandit, I always have a burp cloth. This is actually, uh, it doubles as a bib, so snaps around him. So I always have one of these and I always have a good amount of bibs. So I have one, two, three bibs. So I love these little bandana bibs. They're super cute on him, but these last a good five minutes because he drools so much. And then I have these. And I was asking on Instagram the other day for these because I had these with Addie and I couldn't find them anywhere, but I actually found this at Walmart. So it's actually like a dish towel. There's no snaps or buttons and it just slips over their head. It stretches out, slips over their head. So easy to wash and they're really comfortable and he can't rip it off either. He's getting to the point where he knows how to take his bib off. So these are amazing. I like these mostly for feeding, not for eating solids, not for drool. I think it's a little too big for drool but I have a couple of these. My mother-in-law got me this one. I don't know where she got this from, but these are really great because they're long. So when he's eating solids, I don't have to worry so much about it ruining his outfit. So three bibs. I also have bottles of water. This is mostly for me. And some toys. I have this green teething ring that I got from Thrive Market. These are actually his favorite toy. They're just little keys. They're Green Toys is the brand, I think. He loves these. Little rattle, this was actually Addie's. And this was actually Addie's too. It's a little, I don't know, musical thing. So I always keep a couple toys on me and then I have a couple more hanging on his car seat. So I think that is everything, right? Oh, I did have one other bib. <laughs> Told you, I always keep a lot of bibs. So that's that. That's everything I keep in my diaper bag. It's such a great bag. The inside is wipeable as well. It just makes life a lot easier. And I like that it's big. I can see everything that I have. And I'm not in a bottomless pit. I loved, loved my Vera Bradley one. I'm actually listing it on Poshmark because I just don't use it anymore and I have this one. But as much as I love that one, it was very dark on the inside. And so it was really hard for me to find stuff. I like this because it's just light and bright and easy for me to pull stuff out. So. That is everything that's in my diaper bag. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.